Hello, I am Aaron Sutherland, and in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to access the eLearning Gold videos. You can see on the screen here, I've already logged into our eLearning site. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to navigate to one of our courses. I'm going to go to the SLES Learning Path, and then I'm going to select the SLE 201 course. To access the gold lab environment, we're just going to click on this link right here. That's going to take us to this page. We click on open web page in a new window. A new tab will open up and we're going to see this page right here. Now I click on view course and in this page we can click on the lab URL to start the online lab environment. This will take several minutes as we wait for the lab environment to boot up. Once your lab environment has booted up, you should see a screen that looks like this. All we have to do from here is click on the Virtual Machine Manager icon. That's going to open up this window right here. All we have to do at this point is to power on our virtual machine. So we highlight the virtual machine, click the play button. As the machine boots up, you can click the open button. And this will display the virtual machine console that you will use to interact with the virtual machine. So we'll give this just a few minutes to boot up. Once your machine has booted up, you're going to see a window that looks like this. We will click on the login name, type in the password, and now you are, be you are ready to begin using your virtual machine to perform the steps that are outlined in the lab guide. The lab guide can be found right here. Click on this link right here. And here's our lab guide. We scroll down to the first topic. And then you can begin performing the steps in the lab. So we'll open up the terminal. Type in our username and password. And then there we go. Now, the lab environment will be functional for the duration of your subscription. And when you start a class and then start the lab environment, this lab environment will be active for five days. As long as you come back at some point within the five days, the timer will reset. At the end of five days, the lab environment will be shut down and you will have to start over. Thank you for watching. I hope that this helped and that you enjoyed the video.